An Irish senator has called for the unvaccinated to be completely banned from public transport and supermarkets. And I think, like others have said, gyms, hairdressers, but why not supermarkets? Why not public transport? I know it's difficult to police some of these things, but really, if you want to participate in society, you need to be vaccinated. And if you don't want to participate in society, OK, stay at home. That's your own business. Why not supermarkets? Why not supermarkets? Why not just let people starve to death? Surely that would be the compassionate thing to do. Why not supermarkets? This is the most draconian escalation yet. Even in other European control freak hellholes like France, they still allow the unjabbed to buy food. The senator also called on the mainstream media to take up the narrative of totally banishing the unvaccinated from being able to participate in society at any level or being able to feed themselves. Communities who may not be as tuned into mainstream media, mainstream radio and newspapers and so on, let's make sure they all are yeah, aware you. of the benefits. Why not supermarkets? Yeah, it's moved on quite a bit from not being able to go to the cinema or the nightclub, hasn't it? Remember, Ireland is 94% adult vaccinated. They've had mask mandates for over a year. They've got vaccine passport schemes and where has it got them? Yet another new Covid wave. Now the EU is trying to ban the unjabbed from travelling to the continent entirely. And again, the vaccinated, who can still transmit the virus, will be able to travel freely. But people who can literally prove they don't have the virus, there and then, with the negative test, Forget about it. WHO official Rob Butler has also called on other European countries to consider making vaccines mandatory. And now we have a scary new variant just in time to cancel Christmas. Oh joy. Meanwhile, the public is being prepared for more mask mandates and more lockdowns. Keep complying, idiots. Just keep complying. <laughs>